pop star Lizzo has opened up about her close friendship with fellow singing superstar Adele, and the downside to their relationship. The 35-year-old music sensation also counts former One Direction star Harry Styles as a close friend, and even tunes into Love Island. Lizzo says she is always able to rely on 35-year-old Adele for a fun night out, and says she has to text 29-year-old Harry so he can translate the British slang Love Island contestants use. The About Damn Time star opened up about her friendship with the two British megastars, and explained that there is one downside to hanging out with someone like you singer Adele. She told The Sun on Sunday, Adele is the best drinking buddy, she is a great friend as well but we always have so much fun when we have a night out. The only downside is, I don't always remember everything. She added, I love the British accent but even though we speak the same language, it sometimes feels worlds apart. Especially when I am watching Love Island, I will have to text Harry, Styles, and ask, what does don't mug me off mean? Lizzo wowed fans at Glastonbury over the weekend when she played the main pyramid stage on Saturday ahead of headline act Guns N' Roses. However, the star missed out on playing a headline slot of her own after she took too long to respond to an offer made by organizers. Glasgow boss Emily Evis told Anita Ronnie on Radio 4's Woman's Hour, Lizzo confirmed way after. So when people think, why didn't you put her there? It doesn't really work like that. It would have been a great idea. Lizzo would have been an amazing headliner and hopefully she will headline. The 2023 festival came under heavy criticism for failing to have any female headliners on the main stage. A furrow's backlash was unleashed when the lineup was revealed back in March. Emily tried to explain away the anger earlier this month, telling Cosmopolitan magazine, I think everyone knows that we are trying harder than most certainly extremely hard to address, the gender balance of acts, and I've been very vocal about it. I'm trying my best and, believe me, it's a real, passionate subject of mine. I've been trying to raise the flag around gender and festivals for a long time. But we can only do so much. I just do what I think is right. Because I don't have an agenda, I'm just trying to do the best thing for the festival and make it as fair and equal and brilliant as possible. Follow Mirror Celebs on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. from